Step 1. Unplug the keyboard from the USB or PS2 port. If the keyboard is plugged into PS2 port, you will need to shut down the computer before unplugging it. Step 2. Turn the keyboard upside down and gently shake it to remove dirt and dust. Number 3. Use a can of compressed air to clean between the keys. Step 4. Moisten a cotton cloth or paper towel with rubbing alcohol and use it to clean the top of the keys. Do not pour alcohol or any other liquids directly onto the keys. Step 5. Reconnect the keyboard to the computer once it is dry. If you are connecting it to a PS2 port, you will need to connect it before turning on the computer. If you spill liquid on the keyboard, quickly shut down the computer and disconnect the keyboard. Then turn the keyboard upside down and allow the liquid to drain. If the liquid is sticky, you will need to hold the keyboard on its side under running water to rinse away the sticky liquid. Then turn the keyboard upside down to drain for 2 days before reconnecting it. Please note that the keyboard may not be fixable at this point, but the method above is probably the best option. Optical mice require no internet cleaning because they do not contain any rotating parts. However, they can get sticky over time as dust collects near the light emitter. This can cause erratic cursor movement or prevent the mouse from working properly. Mechanical mice are especially susceptible to dust and particles that can accumulate inside the mouse, which can make it difficult to trap or move properly. If the mouse pointer does not move smoothly, the mouse may need to be cleaned. Unplug the mouse from the USB or PS2 port. If the mouse is plugged into the PS2 port, you will need to shut down the computer before unplugging it. Number 2. Moisten a cotton cloth with rubbing alcohol and use it to clean the top and bottom of the mouse. If you have a mechanical mouse, remove the tracking ball by turning the ball covering counterclockwise. Then clean the tracking ball and the inside of the mouse with a cotton cloth moistened with rubbing alcohol. Allow all of the parts to dry before reassembling and reconnecting the mouse. If you are connecting it to a PS2 port, you will need to connect it before turning on the computer. Dirt, fingerprints, and dust can make your computer screen difficult to read. However, it's easy to clean your screen when needed. There are monitor cleaning kits you can buy, but they may damage your monitor if they are designed for a different type of monitor. For example, a monitor cleaner that is designed for glass screens may not work with some non-glass LCD screens. The safest method is simply to use a soft clean cloth moistened with water. Step 1. Turn off the computer. Number 2. Unplug the monitor from the power. If you are using a laptop, unplug the laptop. Use a soft clean cloth moistened with water to wipe the screen clean. Dust is your computer's main enemy. Use an anti-static cloth to lightly dust your computer casing. Don't use furniture, cleaners, or strong solvents. Use a can of compressed air to blow out debris from the air intake slots. Ammonia, diluted with water or glass cleaner comprised mostly of ammonia and water is a safe cleaning solution for computer surfaces. The milder the solution, the better. Clean the monitor housing and case, but not the monitor and screen. Be spraying a safe cleaning solution onto a paper towel or anti-static cloth and wiping in a downward motion. Don't restrict airflow around your computer. A computer can generate a lot of heat, so the casing has fans that keep it from overheating. Avoid stacking papers, books, and other items around your computer. Many computer desks have an enclosed compartment for the computer case. If you have this type of desk, you may want to position the case so it's not against the back side of the desk. If the compartment has a door, you may want to leave it open to improve airflow.